the world's largest supplier of liquefied natural gas is leaving the biggest oil cartel. After being an OPEC member for more than 50 years, Qatar says the strategic change is needed for its long-term ambitions to produce more natural gas. Qatar announced the decision as the Oil Producing Club of Nations is due to meet on Thursday in Vienna. OPEC is expected to cut oil output amid falling oil prices. Qatar is one of OPEC's smallest oil producers. Its main commodity is natural gas, with the world's third largest reserves. Tensions between Qatar and OPEC's largest producer, Saudi Arabia, suddenly increased when the Saudis imposed a land, sea and air blockade 17 months ago. Qatari government ministers say leaving OPEC is not politically motivated. I don't want to politicize that. I'm a very practical engineer. I've been running QP for a long time. Uh, the way I do business is really practical. So we look at what, you know, where is the value and uh, you know, I like to focus on efficiencies always. And I think it's inefficient to focus on something that's not your core business and something that's not going to benefit you long term. So for me to put effort and, and uh, resources and, and uh, time in, uh, in an organization where I'm a very small player and doesn't ha don't have uh, real you know, say in what happens in that organization, uh, practically does not work. It's not been a great year for OPEC. Its largest members, such as Saudi Arabia, ramped up production while others have carried out cuts, meaning the worst compliance by members in years. OPEC is a bit like a family, and it has all the good aspects of a family, the closeness, but it also has the bad aspects of a family, which means the squabbles. So they all, like in families, they all squabble. And you all are sad when one of the cousins de um, decides to break rank. Qatar's departure comes as both houses in the U.S. have introduced anti-OPEC bills. The so-called NOPEC bill has gained traction after the Trump administration's increased hostility towards OPEC. If passed, the legislation would pave the way for OPEC members to be sued for operating a monopoly. As relations between Saudi Arabia and Russia have improved, Iran, Iraq and Venezuela have found it difficult to abide by wider OPEC decisions. Qatar isn't the first country to leave OPEC, but it is the first from the Middle East, raising questions about whether others could follow. Osama bin Javed, Al Jazeera.